Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel, and we have a new version of Microsoft Edge today. And it follows, of course, the new version of Google Chrome that we had this week. So um, pretty much every Chromium-based browsers follow each other. So check your updates for a new version. And, of course, the bug fixes for the security updates, uh, which is very important. So if you go to Edge and you go into the upper right corner, the uh, three horizontal dots, go down to help and feedback about Microsoft Edge, you will be sent to 129.0.2792.52. Now that said, if you are on 128 long-term support, there's also an update uh, for you. So uh, check that out and it fixes the security flaws also that are in Chromium. What's new? Um, really not much of anything visible, but there are some deprecations of features. So there are things that they are going to remove soon. One of them is a crypto wallet that was within the browser. That is being removed. I guess nobody used that. And um, a few other things that are more into the developer side. Uh, for the security updates, well, you'll have the security updates that come with the Edge Chromium new version. Uh, since um, there was several security updates when Chrome moved to version 129 also. So we're uh, continuing into the uh, endless new versions that don't offer much and that you wonder why they have a new number. But uh, that's the way they are kind of going through. And, um, you know, if I think if we look at the last, you know, both Chromium, uh, Chrome, Google Chrome, and Microsoft Edge, from 120 to 129, um, there's kind of a handful of new features, and they're not really that great. So it's like, okay, oh well. So uh, anyways, uh, moving on slowly to a new Edge browser. Um, and update at least for the security, even if you don't use it, because you know how sneaky Microsoft is, and sometimes links open up with Edge rather than your favorite browser. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.